was a time in my life where I really dreaded this day. Then I met Sam. When Sam asked me to go have dinner with him one night about a year ago, I knew what was gonna happen, I saw it. But he said something to me that is indelible in my heart. He said, all I want to do is serve Chandler. My three pages of questions that I had in my pocket, folded, true, <laughs> meant nothing. I asked these two why they wanted to get married. I asked Sam, why do you want to marry Chandler? And this is what he said, and I'll just read his response to you. He said, the reason I want to marry Chandler is because she boldly and fiercely pursues Jesus every single day. She is incredibly wise and she always teaches me something new, whether she realizes this or not. She is the most loyal and reliable person I've ever met. And she is someone that I know loves me for me, even when I am difficult to love. Not to mention, she is the most beautiful girl I have ever seen. Way out of my league, I am marrying up. <laughs> Chandler said, I said, why do you want to marry Sam? And she said, I'm overjoyed to marry Sam. He has the biggest heart of anyone I've ever known. He loves others with a selflessness that points to Christ, and he remains true to his goofy and lighthearted self. I can't wait to marry Sam because together we are better than we are alone. I didn't, I noticed she didn't say anything about how attractive you are. <laughs> I don't want you to take that personal. I know that she believes that. <laughs> Absolutely stunning. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, you're gorgeous. <laughs> was to protect her heart, and her soul, and her emotions. I'm turning that over to you, and I take that seriously, and I know you do, too. Thank you. Cheers to Sam and Chandler. Sam and this this move that Chandler made to ask him to this take a day and before we knew it we were talking about Sam a lot more and it was pretty clear that he was something special and made Chandler really happy. Just getting to know her was so easy it was never oh, I hang out with Sam and so I know Chandler. She wanted to be friends with us not because we were living with Sam and it would give her brownie points. It was, she cared about us as individuals and that was incredible. It's been incredible to get to know you and see how uh, just the impact you've had on Sam and the way you love him and push him to lead and lead him. And so we're all here to celebrate you and you feel blessed to be married, feel blessed to have us here and you are, but we are here because you blessed us. As a brother in Christ and by the authority entrusted to me as a minister of the gospel, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Sam, you may kiss your bride. Yeah.